This is Roger, and in this video I'm going to show you my Arduino controlled fish feeder. Uh, the fish feeder is controlled by the Arduino and the stepper motor board back here. Uh, but before I show you um, fish feeder in action, I'm going to show you how it can be controlled by uh, remote control in the infrared input on my LCD box. Show my my LCDs uh, that are in this little box I made, and below uh, you can see a little hole which uh, has uh, my infrared sensor, and that's what uh, when I use this Logitech remote here to transmit a signal, that's what's going to pick that up. Uh, this is just a standard universal remote, uh, probably a little more advanced than others, but you don't need. Uh, one like this if you're going to make your own remote controlled feeder. Uh, this one you can set up on your computer to have different activities. Uh, I set one up here called Control Aquarium and underneath that I've got uh, Feed, Day 1, Day 2, uh, which are my uh, lights, my main lights that are on right now, and then also my Sump Day, which is uh, basically that little basket I showed you that has uh, my refugium light and it just went off because every once in a while it will do that to save batteries but if I click this feed here I'm going to try to do it from a decent distance so I can get over to show you what's going on up top and up here my feeder is turning around picking up food and it drops it down below which makes my fish very happy and my humu is going to just pick it out of the sand and my harlequin wrasse is usually not digging out of the sand but he picks up enough. I think they're pretty full and that's one of the problems of having an automatic feeder is uh, you end up feeding your fish probably too much but uh, this feeder is set up not only by remote control but um, I have a timer on the Arduino board that will um, that will feed three times a day uh, at, a, at a set time so I usually don't trigger it by the remote control um, that was just something I added because it's pretty cool um, but in here um, you can see what I have is a stepper motor, and the the, good, the the nice thing about stepper motors is you control the uh, the rotation. So you can say I want the motor to turn only you know 360 degrees. Uh, with a standard motor, you can't do that because um, you just provide power to it. And uh, the stepper motor is microcontrolled by the Arduino, telling it. Uh, how much to rotate and here I have a little access axis through the center of this Tupperware and then I have a pipe as you can see on this end it has an outlet to where it feeds and then on this other end it's got a, uh, a little scooper so as it goes around 360 you saw earlier uh, it'll pick up a little food like so and then as it scoops, it'll go around and it'll drop on the other end. But I don't want to feed again right now, so I'm not going to show you that. Um, if you're wondering what that black uh, bit is there, that's just um, electrical tape wrapped around that pipe to balance out uh, the weight of the pipe uh, so that it's um, perfectly balanced and that helps the stepper um, not... Uh, not over rotate or or to get out of whack and that's my automatic fish feeder uh,